Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Today the topic of our presentation is that why do we procrastinate? Experts define procrastination as a self-defeating behavior pattern marked by short-term benefits and long-term costs. Many of us know it is putting off things that we need to get done. No matter the level of difficulty behind the task is, we sometimes procrastinate because we overestimate that how much can be achieved in a certain time period. It is noted that procrastination is connected to negative functioning and risk to mental health. People who procrastinate tend to have high level of anxiety as well as poor impulse control. Some tips to control procrastination. The surest way to beat procrastination is to start doing what you have been dreading. Stop analyzing the project and just begin to work on it. Once you begin a task, the next steps often flow naturally. So taking the initiative on that first action can be a springboard for momentum. You may end up realizing that the task was much easier than you expected. Second step is to break the task down into small manageable chunks. Sometimes we procrastinate when we feel overwhelmed. If you have been procrastinating a specific project because it feels like too much, make a plan. Start by breaking the activity into smaller, more digestible parts. This makes the overall effort more manageable. Your mind registered that the tasks are small enough to be handled. Kindly note that procrastination is often confused with laziness, but they are very different terms. Procrastination is an active process. That is, you choose to do something else instead of the task that you know you should be doing. In contrast, laziness suggests apathy, inactivity, and unwillingness to act. And if we procrastinate over a long period of time, we may become demotivated with our work, which can lead to depression and even jobless in extreme cases. So we need to understand the reason why we are procrastinating before we can begin to tackle it. Thank you very much. That's all with the presentation. Kindly do let us know about your feedback on the presentation and kindly do subscribe our channel. We wish you best of luck for your future.